Good evening, YouTubers. It's Justin or New Time Travel Jaime 88. Welcome back to my YouTube video vlog for Monday night, August 22nd, 2022. Well, I hope you enjoyed the rest of the Monday evening. You know I did. Well, last night, my team, the Baltimore Ravens, won the pre second preseason game. And beat the Arizona Cardinals final score of 24 to 17. And this Saturday, the Ravens, the Baltimore Ravens will host a final preseason game against the Washington Commanders at 7 o'clock at AMT Bank Stadium. It's the, it's the Battle of the Beltway. Now it used to be um, four preseason games, but it Reduced to three since uh, 2021. And instead of uh, 16 games, the Ravens expand to 17 games, the NFL. And also last night, the Baltimore Orioles won a game and beat the Boston Red Sox final score of five to three. The Orioles is not playing tomorrow night on Tuesday. The, the Orioles, the Baltimore Orioles, will host a three-game series against Chicago White Sox at Camden Yards. And um, I love um, the Baltimore Ravens because I'm wearing purple right now. My purple shirt, that is. Um... Also, as a matter of fact, I also love the Baltimore Orioles too. They're both Baltimore teams, and and the Orioles in itself been along for a long, long time, 1954. But for the Baltimore Ravens, it's 1996. Because Baltimore does not have any football since the Baltimore Colts uh, left Baltimore in 1983. And um, if you want to learn more of that, you can just search it up on YouTube or search it up on Google. And um, next Monday, kids is going back to school in Baltimore City and county because originally they Baltimore County they opened back the school started first and then um, Baltimore City um, opens the following so now is both Baltimore City and Baltimore County their school kids is going back to school uh, kindergarten starts on next Wednesday, which is on August 31st, which is the last day of the month. And um, I know this day do go by fast. And um, as for me, I already gra graduated. Um, so, um, yeah, I just finished... Um, school. The only thing I'm not good at is, is uh, math, all the hard problems, but sometimes I um, do um, succeed. Sometimes I'm stuck on math and others. So, yeah. Now, um, as many of you, as many of you know, on July 30th, 2022, we lost another Star Trek legend, and that is actress Nichelle Nichols, best known to play Lieutenant Lahura on the original 1966 to 1969 television show Star Trek. She is the first African American woman to broke barrier as the first Star Trek, the first multiracial crew. 
and I'm a livid Star Trek fan since uh, 1991. And um, on her on her Instagram, her son uh, wrote this message on on her page. It says, friends, fans, colleagues. And world. I regret to inform you that a great light in the firmament no longer shines for us as it has so many years. Last night, my mother, Nichelle Nichols, scumbles to natural causes and passed away. Her light, however, like the ancient galaxy now being seen for the first time, will remain for us and gener and future generation to enjoy. Learn from and draw inspiration. Her was a life well lived and such a model for us all. I and the rest of the rest of our family would appreciate your patient forbearance as we grieve her loss until we can recover significantly sufficiently to speak fervor. Her service will be for family members and the close of her friends. And we request that her and our privacy be respect. Live long and prosper, Kyle Jackson. And I was sad and she's a very great actress. And uh, when I found out the uh, the news of her passing via on my um, Facebook um, messenger, my friend Spencer has sent me the, the breaking news of the sad news. And I was shocked. And I also, at the same time, back on July 31st, I was watching the Star Trek movie Marathon in honor of, in honor of Nichelle Nichols. And yeah, she's a great actress, a singer, and and um, darn. Um, yeah, I've, I found out from when I watched the news on Michelle's um, passing. And Star Trek um, will pay tribute to Nichelle Nichols on Star Trek Day on September 8th. On last Thursday, I went to the doctor for my annual um, checkup. And I, my doctor told me that I would have, that I would have, keep having, um, uh, chest pain episodes and anxiety attack and um, I just found out that I have a uh, acid reflux because 
uh, I keep having um, burning, like a, a chest pain, like burning through inside of here. When it's inside the stomach and and burning. And so it happens more than twice a week. And also known as GERD, G-E-R-D, which is um, stands for gastroesophageal reflux disease. So, and um, and also I told my doctor that I kept having um, nosebleed episodes. And the doctor told me to take it easy, stay away from some spicy food and so much more, and also start to exercise. And that's what I'm going to do. Because I did exercise the other day and today. And I'm keep so I will keep on exercising every day and also um, my doc other doctor Jeremy Green a very good doctor and he told me that uh, that I am too young to have chest pain that's contributed to stress anxiety and among others so the doctor told me to rest easy and get some rest so, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. Holy smokes. It's 12 midnight already? Oh my. Yep, it's 12.01 a.m. This means I'm going to have to go to bed. That's it for this week's um, live um, video vlog on YouTube. And if you want a chance for a shout out in my next video, comment below and tell me what are you what did you did on for what you did on summer or what are you going to do for summer before you head back to school and also I did help my mom um, cook for dinner and so much more and also we watched the entire Harry Potter marathon last uh, Thursday and we finish up on Sunday so that's it for this week's video vlog have yourself a good night and we'll see you tomorrow good night